Hey everyone, Hardrick Shadow here, and welcome back to Crush Crush. So previously, we had a phone fling with Mio for the first time, and... Well, we spoke to her for the first time in I don't know how long. Nothing much has really changed here. And, yeah, I'm still waiting to get through Cabin Fever to get through... or er, to get to play through Mallory. We have another phone fling. Technically, at the time I'm recording this, which is... April Fool's Day. <laughs> there are actually two phone flings, but since there's just been a, been a lot of things going on with some wisdom tooth pain that I've been having, yeah, I just have not been able to record properly. Anyway, so I'm probably going to be doing this in a batch, so for this episode we are going to concentrate on Quill. I feel like laying on my back, putting your hand on my tummy, and then biting and scratching you. You busy? Alright. <laughs> oh, well actually before we move on, there's an event going on for this animated pe- er, this animated peanut- no. Well, we did have an animated peanut pinup, but no. This one features Sawyer and Lake. Ah, oh, fair lady of the lake! graces us once again. And apparently they're already looking for a VA for her, so... We could be seeing her pretty soon, hopefully. Okay. <clears throat> Sorry about that. Anyway, well, I guess let us go to the phone fling and... Yep, so we have Quill and L here. But like I said, we're gonna focus on Quill for this episode. Package was delivered today. Can I open it? No, you can't. Sure, you don't need my permission, you know. Let me guess, it's a big cardboard box and you want to play in it. Like in that episode of SpongeBob. And our imagination. Maybe. Okay, yes, I'm going for it. The paper is now ripped. The pe er, bah. the peel is now taped. No. The tape is now peeled. The package peanuts are now flying. Wee, they're flying. It's sticking to me. Ah! Yeah, they do that sometimes. I hate static electricity! Excuse me while I flail around for a few minutes. What was in the package? You're too cute. Uh, yeah, you know what? I'll just say that. <laughs> I don't know. <sighs> okay, I, I can't purr. I can't purr the way she purrs, I'm sorry. I'm a happy kitty now, because I'm inside a box. It's the little things. I'M IN A BOX! Okay, no, this... She's not a screaming mime. See? Perfect fit. Yes. I guess about as perfect as you can get it. And... Well, there she is. If it, f if you fits, you sits. Who was it? I think it was the post office who had that. If it fits, it ships. Well, <laughs> oh, I love seeing you so happy and comfy. So happy. As opposed to your plush, who, if I turn around and look at my shelf right now, is just staring at me being so grumpy. I love being so happy and comfy. Hey. During one of my naps earlier, I dreamed that you were stroking me. Then I woke up alone. How could you do that to me? How could this happen to me? I made my mistakes. 
It's not my fault and I'm fading away. Okay, no. If I could be by your side 100% of the time, I would. I'm sorry, I should have been there. Forgive me. <laughs> God, I'm here like, practically pampering her. Like, I'm a bad man. I'll think about it. <laughs> Jeez. I'm a very bad man! <laughs> okay, apparently it's gonna take her 18 seconds to think about whether she's gonna forgive me or not. You know you messed up if it takes her 18 seconds to think about forgiving you. If she does. Okay, if that about it, I forgive you. But don't let it happen again, or I'll scratch up the couch. It's an eye for an eye, okay? Love you. Well... Uh, yeah, I don't know, like, how is that an eye for an eye? So what are you doing today? Not much. Thinking about new ways I can spoil you. Keeping busy. I've got jobs to work, hobbies to practice, and achievements to unlock. <laughs> Speak for yourself. Well, let's see. I mean, for the most part, like, yeah, I have most of these all maxed out. Well, now that Mallory's in the mix, that's the only one I don't have maxed out, obviously, but everyone else, like, yeah, I'm pretty much like, <laughs> look at all this! Look at this! Look at this! I'm freaking unstoppable! So, yeah, I'm just gonna be like, I'm just thinking of ways I can spoil you. That's a good answer. I'm glad you're being productive. Don't forget to take breaks, though. I'd be thinking about having a nap if I were you. I can sleep in my- er, you can sleep in my box if you like. I'm not using it anymore, because it's time for my daily stretches. I'm too sexy for my box. Oh, I forgot to tell you. I can almost put my leg behind my head now. Put your leg behind your head. That means progress is being made. If you want to see, just check out your pet cam. I have a pet cam? <laughs> I don't have a pet cam. You'll have to take a pic and send it to me. That's so impersonal. Send me another cute kitty selfie. I mean, it's the truth. I don't have a pet cam. In this game or IRL. Oh. You mean you don't have a 24-7 livestream of me sleeping, scratching things, sleeping, running back and forth and sleeping? That's sad for you. <laughs> oh, really? <coughs> I don't need you pitying me. I don't need your charity. Okay, well, I guess... Eh, I'll... Yeah, I guess I'll just wait out the five minutes. What the hell. Although, let's see... Oh, wait, that's right. So, Mio actually got a new outfit as well. So, let me show this off while we're waiting. Won't you play with me? I will, just give me a sec here. So she also got a deluxe wedding dress. So if you remember, her original one looked like Princess Peach. And if you don't remember, I'll show you. Don't worry, Tiger. You let me pick the theme of the wedding, and I'll let you pick the theme of the honeymoon. Man, the way she says that is just like, oof. Okay, so we have Princess Peach. Jeez, thanks. If I was a princess, I'd bake you a cake or something. Oh, she actually says something different. Don't worry, Tiger. Oh, jeez, thanks. If I was a princess, I'd bake you a cake or something. I don't know if that was what it was before, but... Well, I only took a look at this outfit once, and I wasn't really looking at the, the text, but... 
So Princess Peach, and now we have Princess Zelda. So yeah, she has like this totally decked out wedding dress, like as if she were Princess Zelda. Mm, I almost want to say it looks, it reminds me a bit more of the Twilight Princess look for her, but eh, I could be wrong. Oh yeah, you're totally touching me to tickle me. I can't wait for you to slip and fall on top of me later. <laughs> When I press my breasts into you and whisper in your ear, do you get chills? Or is it mega awkward? Oh, you're gonna spring that one on me, are you? But yeah, so... This is pretty much what it looks like. So... You got this by just... When there was a sale going on, just buying another uh, pack of diamonds, however many. You know... Sometimes they do that. And yeah, you got the outfit for free. And recently there was one where you could get Nina's Oktoberfest one for St. Patrick's Day, but that's already passed. What about, well, actually what am I saying? Artist Panda voices Mio, so it's possible for her to record new lines on the fly, if I think about it. Cassie, though, I don't know. Hey, what's the good word? Oh, I know! It's you! Fair warning. I'm gonna cry, and my mascara's gonna make me look like a melting raccoon. This is the best day ever! Okay, no. Her lines are the same for this one. So I guess for now, Mio is... Er, Ah, Mio is the only one who has, like, two different lines for both the wedding dresses. Okay. I'm well, glad I was able to show that one off. Although I don't know what else I can show off in L's episode when that happens. <laughs> I feel like laying on my back, putting your hand on my tummy, and then biting and scratching you. You busy? Interesting. Well, they haven't mentioned anything about a wedding, the DX wedding dress for now. Because, like I mentioned, it was Nina's Oktoberfest outfit recently, so. I guess all the girls are gonna get deluxe wedding dresses now. Uh, up till what point, though? I'm bored. Let's travel to Wonderland in a strangely off-genre story twist. Uh, Euro? Time for my daily exercise. 100 squats, 100 push-ups, 100 sit-ups, and a 10-kilometer run. Nice to see you again. I'm glad you haven't forgotten me. The way she says it just makes me feel bad. Going back to the whole thing about how... It's a one-and-done kind of thing, you know? Okay, so Quill's the only one that has that slot op- well, not open, but it's there. So I'm guessing that's gonna be for a future update. Okay. Oh, hello. Well, she even has, like, little stockings with paw prints on them. Ta-da! Ta-da! It's- Gone. Almost there. Practice makes perfect. I am living for this view. We all morality turn, 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 toss a lesson we should learn. <laughs> oh my god. Well. Why not? Dare I say why not? Is it because you can see my toe beans? Toe beans tend to make people happy. There's a whole section. There's even whole sections of the internet. D dedicated to kitty toe beans, or to kitty beans, or kitty toes. Ah, I'm mixing too many words up. Hey, you know, when I was a small kitten, people would always say I was weird. People still say that, so it must be true. Well, I'm weird, but I've already accepted that. And a few of my friends recently even told me, like, they don't think I'm weird, even though. Deep down, I mean, I know I'm, you know... Compared to most people, I'm a lot different, but... Anyway... I can't help but wonder... 
How did someone as strange as me get someone as special as you? Who calls you weird? I'm gonna give them a stern talking to. Weird or not, you're totally wonderful. I'm the lucky one. Even though that's literally like something I would say, especially with my past videos. Hmm, maybe you are, maybe you aren't. I'd rather not argue about it, even though I'm clearly the lucky one. Or I'm clearly the luckier one. So, let's just say we're both lucky. She's so lucky. She's a star. Okay, no. <laughs> Does anyone remember that song? Probably not. <laughs> lucky to have each other. That's the only thing that matters. Ah, oh, you're giving me the warm fuzzy squill. I agree. That's a great way to look at things. I agree with the fish thing! Okay, there's no fish thing. Kitties have very good eyesight. Yeah, I mean, they can see in the dark pretty easily. Versus us, if you turn out, if there's no light, it's like, Ah, oh, I can't see! Where am I going? And I, then you bump into a wall. That's probably why I'm able to look at things so effectively. Although I do wish I could see better in the dark without having to use night vision goggles. They're so bulky. Sorry, what were you talking about? Bungee jumping. I must have stretched too much or rolled around on the floor too hard. I completely lost my train of thought. We were talking about how happy we make each other. We were talking about bungee jumping. That's okay, you can catch the next one. Did you miss the train? Trains can be so cruel! Just like buses. Buses can be so cruel! And herd on the caboose, if you know what I mean. Okay, well. Yeah, that's what we were talking about. Oh, yes. And the answer was... Very. Hmm... I'm definitely getting sleepy again. Okay, well, I'm not waiting 15 minutes, so... Good news! I just saved money on my car insurance by switching to Geico! No. I found a very nice patch of sunlight on the floor. I'm gonna lay here for a while. Okay, I'm glad you did not slap me with a three-day waiting time. It's toasty, warm, and quiet, and peaceful. I can already feel my eyelids getting heavy. My cute sleepy girl, enjoy your nap. Close your eyes, let yourself drift away, and dream of me. <laughs> or did I cast a Nova over here? Okay, let me try that again. Close your eyes, let yourself drift away, and dream of me. See you more. Okay, no. Bye. Sensual. Noche. Romantica. Melodia. I'm sure I will, because I always do. Thank you for giving me all the attention I wanted. Thank you for giving me something to pay attention to. <laughs> Anytime. All you have to do is meow. We all morality turn, 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 tell us the lesson we should learn. Okay, I guess I'm, little, I'm gonna say this one. <laughs> There's always more where that came from. Okay. I'll be dreaming of you. Oh, my... I cannot listen to that Selena song without crying, just because... I end up thinking of the movie, and... Well... I know the movie's kind of old, but... Like, seriously. It's not quite accurate to Selena's life, but I mean, it's... I mean, it's worth a watch to me. Bye for now. Okay. So that's Quill 
done. And now, I guess, join me next time when we are going to talk to L for the first time in forever. So see you guys then. Stay golden and later, folks.